More and more people are using crowdfunding sites to get donations for their cause. The site GoFundMe has helped people raise more than $3 billion since it started in 2010. But crowdfunding sites do take a cut of your donations. And that has Marianne from Elk River wanting to know, how does GoFundMe work? Good question. Here's Heather Brown. You've given to a GoFundMe account. Yes. For a cancer friend of mine. Go music education! <laughs> it was for a young gentleman who was writing a play. Remember how we used to ask people to give? A fund has been set up in his name at Wells Fargo. The family has set up a donation fund at Wells Fargo Bank. What has changed? I think we're spending increasing amounts of time online. Fallon's Marty Weatherall helps businesses with crowdfunding. I think what GoFundMe and Kickstarter and Indiegogo, they've all sort of created a new culture that is increasingly familiar. And increasingly shareable with personal stories. It kind of spread to larger communities around us because of social media. How much money do you think GoFundMe takes out of it? I have no idea. I don't know. Is it a nonprofit? No. Never even thought about that. Huh. Yeah. How much do they take? 5% of the amount donated and a 2.9% plus 30 cent credit card processing fee. Where does that 5% go? Well, there's pretty large staffs of people uh, running these sites. Um, when they get all the traffic that they get and when they're processing all these payments, uh, they have cost of doing business. Their competitors have similar fee structures, but one site, you caring, charges that credit card fee and then asks people to voluntarily give an extra 5 to 10 percent. We have people that have written to us and say, oh, not all my money goes to this cause. Why should I go through a GoFundMe then? Well, it's a good question. I think for the person raising funds, they need to decide if the value of that visibility on a popular fundraising site. Because it would never have reached me otherwise. Versus kind of going it on your own and coming up with your own solution that people aren't as familiar with. I think he's brilliant. I think he'll do something interesting. Heather Brown. All because of you. All because of my $25. <laughs> WCCO 4 News. GoFundMe says it uses the best secure payment encryption technology available. Beneficiaries can withdraw funds from their accounts as soon as donations come in. Withdrawals usually take five to seven days. If you have a good question for Heather, please email it by going to wcco.com links.